Weatherbug.com meteorologist Addison Green here on this fine Friday talking about your national headlines. And we're going to be dealing with the possibility of seeing some pop up thunderstorms, especially in some of the intermountainous areas in the western third of the nation. But unfortunately, those, fire, those areas, I should say, are dealing with some wildfires. And so we need the rain, but sometimes it's so dry, the rain doesn't make it all the way down to the ground. We have pleasant conditions going on in the upper Midwest towards the Great Lakes. And we have a lookout for your national forecast where hopefully you, uh, you don't have to deal with too much activity outside your neck of the woods, unlike what they're seeing across portions of the west, where we have the Rin Fire in California, a massive fire burning across portions of the Sierra Nevadas. They have to use a lot of support from above because the terrain is so treacherous to traverse. And over here across near the Colorado Front Range, near Lakewood, Colorado, looks like a winter wonderland scene, but no, that's hail. A lot of it falling down about a quarter to around ping pong in diameter yesterday. You can see all those green dots indicating the hailstones. Blue dots indicating wind reports were across the eastern third of the nation. Rainfall still coming down in the wee morning hours across near portions of Colorado, Wyoming, although it's fading away as the daytime hours progress. Like this front right here, fading away as it's approaching the northeastern seaboard. So not a whole lot of fanfare with that frontal boundary as it's trying to bring some scattered showers to the area. Jet stream kind of dipping down to the north and east, but still riding up a big ridge developing across the central plains and warm and monsoonal seasonal flow flowing in across the southwest. So we're going to be dealing with more pop-up chances for thunderstorms across that region, as well as seeing some scattered thunderstorms develop in the southeast. Rainfall amounts could be near three-quarters of an inch towards Atlanta, nearly six-tenths of an inch towards Denver. And northwest still dealing with fire concerns out there for the day today. Highs in the northeast, Portland 79, New York City 84 degrees. In the southwest, some places are hitting the triple-digit mark. Here's looking at forecast conditions as we go coast to coast, and stay tuned right here for more.